You good girl. I'm right here and this is a copper beech seedling. I'm gonna dig these all up in the next few minutes. So here's another beech tree seedling. And then after those initial leaves come up, this is, you can now see the true beech leaves. These are all baby beech trees. And I'm gonna dig them up and transplant them into pots to plant elsewhere. So you can see more beech tree babies. There's another beech tree baby and a beech tree baby. It's like a pair of kidneys, their first uh, leaves that come up. So if you didn't know any better, you wouldn't know what it was. But then when the second pair come up, you can tell it's a baby beech tree. And what's kind of nice, that's the traditional beech tree. But what's nice is you can see the different color these leaves are. This is a baby copper beech. And right above me is the copper beech. But see, those beech trees over there are the most predominant ones. Those are the green beech. So I'm very pleased to find some baby copper beech seedlings. So I will transplant them into pots to then be transplanted out in an area that I want to plant some beech trees come the autumn. So a baby copper beech. So here I've transplanted the copper beech seedlings that I picked up. You can see there's one with a very coppery leaves. And then these are the bog standard normal kind of beech trees. So I've only put them in these small trays just for them to start to grow on. I'm watering them. And the place they're in is between some buildings and this is, uh, the dogs took out all of my um, little signposts, so I don't know what I've planted in that. It's trees, I know it's tree seeds. So I don't know what it is, and who is that? Amazing copper looking beetle. It's a beautiful copper color. I don't know if you can see there, look at that. Gorgeous looking beetle. You're very powerful. It's digging to go through my fingers. Very beautiful. Shiny, glossy beetle. So I'm going to put you up there. Anyway, so the, there, see what I mean? Look, look at that. They've got one of my tags from one of my other boxes. Excuse me, can I have that please? Thank you. This was to, oh, it doesn't even have any writing on it. Now they're stealing them from wherever the supply is. You're bold. You're such bold dogs. Anyway, the seedlings are between this building, which is my office and the shop and the stable going into the yard. So the sun only gets a brief look at them during the day, so it kind of mimics being in the shade of their parent tree. No, look at you, you're stealing one. I caught you in the act. So these are, there's more trees in here. See, look, there's walnut trees in here. And then this is sweet chestnut. So those are the edible chestnut trees that are planted there. So the, this is my tree collection, but some of the trays, I'm not gonna know what the trees are until they come up because certain people are stealing the labels. Excuse me, spats, leave my labels alone. I think what I might have to do is put the label in sideways like that and make it disappear. And the walnut one as well. That way they won't be tempted but that tray right there is gonna remain a mystery until the seedlings come up. Anyway, hopefully the dogs won't have fun digging in those boxes. And there they go, into my seedling boxes. So you can see from the shadows cast by the big old wheels 
Those are wheels that would have been on a sugar beet uh, plow thing, or I can't remember what they're called, but those huge wheels would have been either side of what would have dug up sugar beet for harvest for sugar. And we don't have that kind of harvest anymore. Look at that, you're trying to dig up even though I've hidden it in there. God, you're so bold. Anyway, hopefully those beech trees will all take and I will have a whole bunch of beech trees to plant come autumn. Ah! Oh, 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 I am so sorry. I am so sorry, Pepper. I didn't see you, I walked backwards onto you. Are you okay? Yes, you're fine. You're good boy. I am so sorry, that was not funny. You're an old man and it's just rude being awakened by big, huge feet. You good boy. <laughs> oh, yeah. Bless you, pups. Yes.